welcome to the garden. Today I'm excited to give you an update on my experimental terrarium growing moss from spores. You may be able to see just a little bit of green here in the foreground and some green here in the background. Those are the first sprouts of our moss. It's actually starting to work. That's really cool. And this is growing a lot more than moss too. Turns out we're growing some sort of weird moldy fungus thing. Look at this network. It's incredible. It's branching out in a fractal pattern. really not sure what this is, but it's really beautiful. It's taken over this entire side of the terrarium. Look at that. This is in a whiskey bottle. It spent about a month outside in the cold before I brought it indoors over winter. So this was actually frozen solid at one point. I did think that maybe the moss might need that kind of winterization. A lot of seeds actually need that cold period in order to germinate. Since we just collected these spores from out back, these are used to having that cold winter. But that's definitely fresh moss. That's really exciting. Besides the moss, we do have a bit of algae. Most of it's actually under the soil though, so it's not that big of a deal, but it's all around the edges. I have been giving this a little bit of sun just to kind of encourage that green growth in the moss. That gray speck right in the center could be mold, so to combat that we can actually crack the lid. That'll help it breathe a little bit and dry out. If you get any funny smells, you can just cap it back up. Just in the past few days, a lot of these little spheres have popped up. They kind of look like egg sacs almost. They're kind of all over this side of the jar. So I'll keep an eye on those too. But they appear to be on this sort of webbing stuff, this fungal network. So it may be a creature that lives off of that, like some of these little mites perhaps. And these are everywhere outside. You just don't see them because they are minuscule. Let me get my finger in here for some scale. It is just ridiculous how small they are. Look at that. But the moss is definitely starting to take over. It seems to like the edges right now. There's a good deal over here. There's a little bit over here. And then on this end too, just along the edge. So I am happy to report that this experiment was a success. You can grow moss from spores. I'm really happy this actually worked. And hopefully it'll spread. There's a lot of space yet left to fill. But I'm confident that those spores are scattered all throughout the terrarium. 
I will definitely have more updates as interesting things happen. But if you want to see how I set this terrarium up, you can click on this video right over here. And to check out my full terrarium playlist, you can check out these right over here. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you next time.